I'm James Vallis. Passenger flights at Brussels Airport, which was the target of two suicide bombings earlier this week, will remain suspended until at least Tuesday morning. That according to airport officials, more than four days after the attacks. A small group of engineers of Brussels Airport Company received permission on Friday afternoon to assess the damage and to begin preparations to at least partially resume passenger flights. New security measures will also be implemented. The airport said in a statement on Saturday, the team will examine the stability of the building, check the functioning of the information technology systems, assess the material damage, and determine the process to renovate the terminal. Because of the expected work, no passenger flights are expected until at least Tuesday morning, but further delays are possible. Cargo planes and private aircrafts, which do not require the departure hall, were able to resume operations on Wednesday evening. Brussels Airport is one of the largest airports in Europe, handling 23.5 million passengers and some 489 tons of freight every year. The airport has been closed since Tuesday when two suicide bombers blew themselves up inside the airport, killing nine people. A third suicide bomber blew himself up at a metro station in Brussels, killing 19. For the very latest on the Brussels terror attacks, stay with BNONews.com for continuing coverage and follow us on Twitter at BNONews for instant updates. 